couple of mongoose that are playing just off of Triple M on an animal pathway. So there's actually quite a few of them here and hopefully they're going to come back out again. They were playing so nicely. But it's typical for them to bob and weave in the long grass. They don't want to stay out in the open for too long because if they do, they run the risk of being spotted by a predator of some sort, mostly a bird of prey, a raptor of some sort. We'll, s we'll swoop on over and snatch them up. Hello. Look, 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 it's mom. Mom feeding them. Did you see she had something in her mouth, a worm of some sort, and now the little pups have come over to try and, of course, snatch it up. Oh, look how tiny they are. Hello, little one. Very hungry and very satisfied with that, obviously, as well as it licks its lips. Yum, yum, yum. Delicious. And I love the way that they get so excited. And, and it's really interesting, and this is another reason why I love winter so much, is because as the grass disappears, we get to spend so much time with the dwarf mongoose. And those of you who have been watching for years and years, you know how valuable and how entertaining these little characters uh, can be. So, the grass hides him. So let's, um, let's bring on the big herds of buffalo, elephants, zebra, you name it, everything that eats grass, and hopefully they'll flatten it for us because I'd love to see some of these little ones growing up and, of course, foraging with, with mom and the rest of the family. But that's what they'll do on a morning like today. We didn't get too much sunlight, so they're not having to warm themselves up. I had to actually put a jacket on because I feel as though it's got colder. But these mongoose, instead of warming up on a sunny termite mound, they thought that they'd give that a skip and just go straight into looking for food for the day. There's another youngster. Now, the only reason I can tell that it's a youngster is because it's so small compared to the adults. But they always exhibit uh, that adult behavior, running around, scavenging. Now, it sounds like there's quite a few of them. There's lots of chit-chatter, okay, living in Termite Mount somewhere around here. But we're going to carry on. I'll give you...